finding himself cured one of them turned back praising god at the top of his voice gratitude is a matter of realization gratitude is a matter of realization you look back and you realize how blessed you are you look back and see the the journey you have made and the hearts and the hands that carried you all along the way you feel immensely grateful in gratitude is forgetfulness you are looking looking ahead and you fail to look back and looking ahead you may have a lot of things to worry about to cry about even to feel angry about because all you can see are the things you haven't got the things you miss and the things you wish for and to pray for and all you have is a kind of a discontentment a grumbling murmuring mind inside you can't see anything positive but then the truth is you are not seeing the truth as it is always learn to look back with the gratitude you may say some of the things were not really good in the past but if you are wise enough that's the right word if you are wise enough you will see even those the really bad things or sad things or disappointments and all those things were really really good for me even those people who hurt me and insulted me hated me they also did me something good it needs wisdom it needs really wisdom and a faith to see life that way even though sad things and bad things disappointments hatred rejection all those things and all those people who did the they all did me good they all blessed me in god's way in other words you have only gratitude no disappointment about the past only gratitude may i say this to you if you are a, if you have if you are a grateful person you won't need prayer books some say i forget by i i forgot to say my morning prayer forgot to say my evening oh why why do you need prayer books why do you need why do you need prayer books if you have a, if you have got a heart that is grateful your heart is full of gratitude you won't need prayer books as somebody has to tell give you the word say this word have you got something of your own has somebody to teach you you have to pray this way this is the prayer why don't you make your own prayer why don't you have your own words of thanksgiving you won't need prayer books only when if you, you have learned to pray without books i would say that is real prayer the other is routine and habit you feel happy i did my morning prayer and my evening prayer or you feel happy but but that is not nothing from the heart from the routine and the practice silly habits the other is real prayer oh you feel so grateful you give thanks to god even though you are going through suffering and pain you still you feel grateful that's why before the petition thanksgiving why do you make petitions 
You won't need that. Because you trust in God, you believe God is good, so I give a thanks to him. Petitions are in the footnote. God has seen those petitions before you open the mouth. Make sure your heart is full of gratitude and full of thanksgiving. Then your life will be a never-ending 